So hello and welcome to the Inside This is Antica. My name is Antica Alicia and I am a trauma transformer. I train other trauma transformers and this is my life work. So I want to introduce you to me a little bit and my intention behind this vibe raising course. Oh my gosh, after trauma, it's like there's so much sensation when we walk through trauma. It doesn't matter if it was childhood trauma or um, physical trauma or emotional trauma or mental trauma or spiritual trauma um, or if it was all of it combined. No matter what trauma you walked through, what happens when we're walking through trauma, the definition of trauma is the inability to cope. And when we are unable to cope, our mind can't make sense of things. Our emotional body just goes, and we get turned on in survival mode. Our body gets stuck in fight, flight, or freeze. And it's like, fuck, chaos. <laughs> um, and oftentimes, the emotions that are brought up in trauma is regret is shame and guilt, sadness and fear. And so in order to get a high vibration from these, it takes a lot of courage. So today I'm gonna to talk to you about these low vibrational emotions and what chaos they can create in your life and an endless cycle of abuse. It, um, the feelings create like mindset stocks and beliefs and assumptions. The beliefs create illness and autoimmune disease in the body. These, um, it's like this ripple effect of crap when we feel like crap. And it's really hard to pull yourself out of it. And when you have pulled yourself out of it again and again and again, it can get extremely tiring. So first off, I want you to know that I understand. I understand this being knocked down again and again and going, how the hell am I going to get up? And why isn't anyone here to pick me up? And why do I feel like this again? I understand not knowing and trusting myself to feel pleasure. I understand not even knowing what happy looks like. I wanted to be happy, but I didn't know what happy was. I didn't have an image or an understanding of happy. <laughs> and many of my clients don't. One of the things that we do in the vibrational zone and the emotional zone is we define the emotions for ourselves. And what I've learned by working with hundreds of people is this is very, very personal. There is nothing about our emotions that is um, collective. Uh, we have an idea of it and we can sense and feel other people's emotions, but your experience of the the emotions are very, very different. So I'm gonna cover that. So the first video that we're going to do today is about what are the emotions, what is the emotional body, and really the studies that they've done about emotions. The effect that the emotion has on water and how our body is so much water and how we can utilize that for growth and our benefit. Also, the, um, just understanding of how we can now literally through kinesiology and muscle testing as well as through hooking up devices and triggering emotions in people read on a richter scale um, the vibration the pulse of emotion and this pulse is what is like the radio wave or the cellular wave that comes out of our body into the world and bounces back at us. So it creates our experiences. It, it creates what we perceive and what we attract. It is manifestation and action. So when you can face it and shift it, which is my hope and desire for you in this series, um, you can shift your entire life. All right, the next piece that we're gonna talk about is in the next short video, I'm gonna to try to keep these pretty short, but I have a lot that I wanna cover, is the lower emotions and how you can work through them and feel them 
and a different perspective from them. And I want to share this perspective with you because it offers you a ton of freedom. And it's a way to utilize your power, your brain power, to really bring yourself back into your emotional power. And so I'm going to share that with you in segment two. And we're going to talk a little bit in there about um, ways that I work with people privately and in a group setting. And also, if you feel called to do this work, I'm going to share a little bit about um, my two certification programs as a trauma transformer or a yogi. Um, the final segment of this vast experience here is this icky topic of anxiety and worry. And I want to give this um, an entire thing because trauma really activates our anxiety. And this is activated on every level. It affects us mentally as our mind spins in stories and thoughts that we can't get out of. This affects us physically as weight gain or weight loss and our adrenals and failing our adrenals and then we like, oh, the autoimmune diseases that that causes. And it's stressful. It's stressful. Our cortisol levels go up. It affects you completely. So we're going to talk about how to redo this and um, why it leads into your next power zone, your spiritual zone, and why it's so important to look at yourself as a holistic person. Holy. And so I hope that you enjoyed this mini class and that we get to know each other, that you make comments in your Facebook group. The link is here for you to join that group if you haven't already and that you gain freedom. And if you feel like working together with me privately or you're interested in one of the group courses coming up and access to the immediate workbooks, um, let me know.